Okay. So. Mach mal. Hier weiter. <lacht> Schauen mal, was uns weiter erwartet. The book, uh, the book projected peers into the body of Dr. Colen. The detective watched helplessly as Bradley's friend carried out her injury. Confronted with the experiments of Fuller, she got into his office and discovered that the director of the Riverside Institute was hiding information on, if not the body of, Sarah Hawkins. But she was discovered by Fuller. Pierce must save her before it's too late. Okay. Done. Schauen wir mal. Wenn's irgendwann mal geladen hat. Hallo, Pater. Willkommen. Hast viel verpasst? Uh, von Cthulhu noch gar nichts. Haben gerade erst angefangen. Das einzige, was du verpasst hast, war der Meerestempel in Zeller. Aber der war jetzt auch nicht so. Auch nicht so. spektakulär. <lacht> jo. Ah, uh, nicht wundern, ich bin heute ein bisschen müde irgendwie. Nicht so ganz bei der Sache. Aber sollte hoffentlich nicht allzu sehr äh, einschränken. So, das Spiel hat auch endlich mal geladen. Wunderbar. I pray that Colden is really here and alive. Okay. Was ich mich gerade frage ist, wo ist der Typ aus dem Bücherladen? Den haben wir ja glaube ich mitgenommen. Keine Ahnung, wo der ist. Diary of the Pastor's Wife, Volume 1, Diary of Reverend Wickwood's Wife, her husband John built the first Hawkins home called Hilltop at the end of the 17th century. They were among the first white colonists of the island. The previous inhabitants disappeared mysteriously three centuries earlier. An old diary. Aww. Mysterious. What the? No, mehr Fuller too. Mensch. How old is Fuller really? 1849. Hmm. Right. Enough time wasted. Colden needs me. I must find her. Uh, dürfen, dürfen die mich sehen? Glaube fast nicht. Nein. Was? Oh. No. No. Ah. Was? My God, what, what is happening to me? What? what was that? It's as if I'd been transported somewhere else. What Whoa. happened? What? Something has changed, but what? Ha! Interesting.
War more delinquente. This pseudoscientific work by Cesare Lombrosco. Lombroso correlates an individual's morphology with his criminal predispositions. The seriousness of his study and the accuracy of the demonstrations can be deceive, can deceive an uninformed reader. Also, angeblich, das ist angeblich ein Zusammenhang zwischen dem Aussehen von Leuten gibt und deren Verbrechen, die sie begangen haben. I've seen this symbol. Increase your lamp's brightness. Oh. Awaken and free me. Leviathan. What? Ah, oh, okay. Interessant. Mal wieder Öl finden oder sowas. Das sind noch Secret Sciences. Okay. Also, so ganz zu 100% verstehe ich es noch nicht, was hier abgeht. Aber es ist interessant. Und ein bisschen creepy. Ich nehme an, jetzt brauche ich wieder die rote Laterne. Okay, das bringt nichts. Oder auch keine rote Laterne. das Ding. Ich hab's gesehen. You are confronting powers that surpass you.
da ist Dr. Fullers Büro. Hm. Mag die Geräusche nicht. Seit wann stream ich? Seit 18 Uhr. Aber an sich hast du nicht super viel verpasst. Äh, Meerestempel in Zelda Spirit Tracks. Und äh, ja, mit Cthulhu haben wir vor ein paar Minuten erst angefangen. Ich habe übrigens ähm, die Umfrage zu Danganronpa ausgewertet ähm, und ein was hat mich doch sehr überrascht. Ein, ein bestimmtes äh, Ding hat mich, hat mich sehr überrascht, was da rausgekommen ist. Ah! Gruselig. Was denn? Ähm. Nämlich, ähm. Die letzten beiden Fragen waren ja. Äh, einmal Lieblingsspiel und das Spiel, das man am wenigsten mochte. Und. It looks like things are back to normal. Interessant. Und es gab entweder entweder es gab entweder Leute, deren Lieblingsspiel Danganronpa 2 war und das Spiel, das sie am wenigsten mochten, ähm, Ultra, Ultra Despair Girls war. Und es gab Leute, deren Lieblingsspiel Ultra Despair Girls war, aber deren Spiel, das am wenigsten mochten, Danganronpa 2 war. Und ansonsten gab es keine anderen Leute. Also entweder, entweder so oder so. Hat mich... Hat mich sehr, sehr überrascht. Was? Oh, cool. Erinnert ein kleines bisschen an The Evil Within. What's going on? It never ends.
Hey, das bin ich. Damnation. That's. That's me. Oh. Oh, was? Oh Gott. Nice. I gotta get out. Ah. Wow. Das ist cool. Pierce, I found her. I finally know what's going on. You cool. must live and find the truth. Uh, okay. It's already too late for me. Hold him. What's going on? What's going on? Was it a hallucination? <gasps> oh. Please take a seat and be quiet, Mr. Pierce. I'll be with you in a moment. Wo weißt du, dass ich das bin? Stop whatever the hell you're doing and turn around now. <lacht> Die ist tot. No, it can't be. No, you son of a bitch! What did you do to her? I wish I could have done more experiments on you, Mr. Pierce. <lacht> I said, what did you do to her? You shouldn't be sorry for your friend. You should envy her. Murder! This madness must stop. Ja, so was macht man nicht verhaften. Colden? Nicht umbringen. Verhaften. Wenn dann. Das ist ein Penis? Penis mit Tentakel. Gut. Gut. They do to you. Can you speak? Where is it? 
He gave him the gold and I, the azure. I don't see him very often anymore. The green is stronger. Are you feeling ill? I'm here, but no. No. Let's get you out of here. It comes in my dreams. Our minds melt like colors on a palette. Come with me. It's is of the oldest green. A violent living, vibrant. A sea green, maybe. No. No. Mrs. Hawkins, we must go before someone finds out. Oh, but he will. He always knows these things when it's about me. I have seen the same color. It was not as vivid as you said. A pale copy. A discarded spawn. Do you know what it was? Tell me. I can't. We should not call his name. Terrible, terrible consequences. All right. Come with me. He will know. He will find us. One more reason to hurry. Have I seen you before? Can you walk? Maybe. Then let's go before your husband finds us. It was in your studio. What? You painted me. That's where you saw me. Of course. Hmm. The men in white are coming. You mean the guards? This way. Follow me. What the? Oh no. You there. No. You won't get far. Come out of your hiding place. Okay. Und jetzt? Wait. The machine. Was? It's the green, the decaying one. The gas. Yes. It's not good for living beings. We don't have time for that. I am not moving until the wrong is set right. Damn it. Okay. Von mir aus. Äh. Hm. Schalter. I'd be better off finding a tool. Cool. Perfect. Perfect. Oh. All right. That should do it. Let's move. Oh. Ah, it's a doctor, man. Crazy island. Oh. You are going nowhere. Don't get between me and my wife. Yeah. Play with her. Stop. 
I did everything I could to protect her. But her identity, her power, is what threatens her. What? Sarah has seen things, has made things you can't even begin to imagine. Would you still save her if I told you that she is even more dangerous than I am? Weak, physically, and mentally. Do not make the mistake of thinking she's a feeble woman. <laughs> Sarah has been in the presence of the myth for too long. Even if she were to leave Darkwater, she would still hear his call. And the cult will always be here. Waiting for her. Then we get rid of its members. You are out of your league, detective. They control the whole island. She will finally surrender to his power, and the world will fall with her. Don't! No one can escape the wheel of destiny. They say, but I will change it. I will save Sarah. Oh! Warte denn jetzt eine Axt her? Was? After the death of Colden Pierce, victim of hallucinations advanced inside the Riverside Institute to the point of discovering Sarah Hawkins alive, prisoner of Dr. Fuller. The last confrontation between Charles Hawkins and his wife has revealed that the man under his monstrous appearance tried to protect her from the influence of the myth. He warned Pierce if Sarah succumbs to the lure of the occult. She will lose all free will, allowing the cult to bring its plan to fruition, summon an ancient and evil god. Henceforth, Piers must know more about Sarah Hawkins' intentions and find a way to protect her. <coughs> no parent should have to bury their child, knowing it's me that put him there. The guilt, the guilt will never go away. I feel your pain. I'll do anything to get him back. Anything. My work was what lured me here in the first place. It began showing me things. Charles should never have seen. What am I to you? <clears throat> I took care of you 
saved you from your miserable life. You'll never find a man better than me. You owe me. I owe you nothing. We'll leave now. You're not going anywhere. <laughs> Come on, it's over now. Sieben Punkte. Mr. Pierce, we were waiting for you. Good. Sarah doesn't have much time. What are you doing here? <laughs> Did you think I would let you confront the occult without supervision? This is too dangerous for a bookworm like you. Algernon, I need to talk to Mr. Pierce. Very well, Sarah. I will be in Charles Hawkins' office. Okay. You seem different. Yes. When I woke up this morning, my mind was sharper. Cleaner. I can still hear the voice calling me. It is so strong. So ancient. Enticing. Dangerous. I may never be able to escape his grip, but for now, I can keep it at bay. I know what I owe you, Mr. Pierce. But I can't come back to Boston with you. I saw everything. The tunnels under your house, the rituals, the secret society. I must get you out of its reach. I know how dangerous they can be to me. But first, there's the Wanderer. I must find it and kill it. I am the only one who can end its slaughter. No. No, you will come with me to Boston. I owe you no obedience. This isn't about what you want or don't want to do. You would risk destroying the world just because you can't face the consequences of your actions. I am willing to atone for my sins. No. You're just trying to erase all proof of the mistakes you've made. I know what I have done. I will not rest until the creature is sent back to its dimension. You can't give up. Even knowing the stakes. Yes, thank you. Still, I won't let you go. What? You will stay here until I find a safe way to return to Boston. That's ridiculous. Listen, 
Algernon knows of a way to protect me. Help him find what he seeks, and we may all survive this battle. All right. I'll help you. Hmm. Was Sarah Hawkins telling the truth? What kind of ritual was she preparing? Was the painting of the Shambler displayed here? Mrs. Hawkins never told me why she was in possession of the Necronomicon. How did she survive her encounter with the Shambler? Knowing Mrs. Hawkins, I bet she was willing to fight. Charles Hawkins was ready to do anything to protect his wife. In here. How are you, Bradley? Ah, it's you, Pierce. I'm just <coughs> worried about Marie. I mean, Dr. Colden. Oh. Have you had any news? Uh... I'm so sorry, Bradley. I could do nothing to save her. What do you mean? What happened? I'm not sure what happened. But I found her body in the cellars of Riverside. You... You sure that you've got nothing to do with it? If she hadn't tried to help you, she might still be alive. I'm sorry. Truly. It's that slug, Fuller. I swear I'll shoot him. What do you Good. say, Pierce? Are you with me? Yeah. Have no fear, Bradley. Dr. Fuller will not escape the clutches of destiny for long. Sooner or later, he will be judged for what he has done. You just need to have faith. What are you talking about? What's this story of destiny? No, I'm sorry. I'm not going to wait for some mystical intervention. I'll take care of him. Myself. We must do something for those who are still alive, Bradley. Sarah is still in danger as long as the cult is active. We need to see this through, otherwise Marie's death will have been in vain. You're, uh, the voice of reason, Pierce. As always. I prefer to be alone. Hmm.
Seeing you again. Ah, it's you. I'm here for her, not you. I don't care why you're here. Your usefulness is the only thing that matters. How do we protect Mrs. Hawkins from the influence of the forces that claim her? By following Charles Hawkins, that imbecile of a thief, of course. What do you mean? He found something. An amulet. The symbol engraved on it could protect Sarah. Could? We are dealing with forces that by far surpass what your intellect can process. Feel free to ask me any question regarding the matters that exceed your grasp. What is the true nature of the Necronomicon? I see that you are interested in my precious book. It is the definitive book of knowledge of the occult, Mr. Pierce, written by Abdul Alhazred. It is the answer to many a question. That is why it's so highly valued. Yes, and even though it is a copy, given to me as a gift by Professor Armitage of Miskatonic University, the work remains very powerful. I understand better why you keep it in a safe. A genius like you must have already found a way to get rid of this creature, yes? I sense your sarcasm, but it does happen that, yes, I do have a solution. I think I can destroy it, but for that I must approach the creature. And to be able to do so, I need the key to Rie. Another one of your baubles. It is no bauble, unbeliever. It is a very powerful protection able to repel very ancient forces, much more effective than your cult. What does it look like? It is a golden amulet, bearing very ancient inscriptions and an elder sign at its center, a star with an eye in the middle. I've already seen that sign. Where can we find it? Therein lies the problem. That foul thief Charles has hidden it somewhere. <laughs> I found this drawing among his personal effects, I think that it has something to do with the location of the amulet. I'll follow this lead. You continue searching. That is what I intend to do. <coughs> As for you, return here the second you find it. I don't want it to disappear again. <coughs> okay. Okay. Kopf. Tada. Sketch must guide me to the artifact. Uh, okay, there's a star in the bibliotheque. It's you again. Tja. I think I've found what we're looking for. Let me see that. Yes, that's it. It's perfect. 
We are saved. I must tell Mrs. Hawkins. Yes, do that. Wetten, wetten, wenn ich mit der jetzt gesprochen habe, ist der Typ weg. Hat das, hat das Kackamulett geklaut. I have it. It's a strange amulet. I hope it will protect you, considering that nothing will help you change your mind. You must understand, I already went too far. What have you seen that's so terrible you convinced yourself that you had to risk so much? I can't tell you now. This story is going to end badly. Yes! Chief West huh. is here with Sullivan. Okay. Bradley, you take care of Sarah. I will deal with them. You sure? All right. I've been hearing about you a lot lately. You seem to enjoy causing trouble. Nice job, Chief. You got me. Great police work. You can try to play smart with me all you want, Pierce. Witnesses have identified you as the one who set fire to Riverside. Witnesses? How convenient. <coughs> That's not the whole story, is it? I don't care about your stories. Save them for the judge. You know, us cops, we base our investigation on facts and testimonies. You might want to try that next time. Hmm. You bet I will. Dark Water Police Station, with the help of Ergen Erg Erg and Drake, Pierce has obtained an amulet that is supposed to protect Sarah Hawkins against the evil powers that con uh, that covered her. The painter told him of her desire to track and kill the dimensional Shamblin in order to atone for her sins. Before Pierce could stop her, he was arrested by the police. Hmm. Wird mir auch gefallen. Mal schon. You know, I've heard a lot about you, Mr. Pierce. All good, I hope. It appears that you've been involved in a variety of misdemeanors since your arrival on Dark Water. Entering private property twice. Aggression, insulting behavior, and to top it all, arson. Listen, Chief West, I realize that I'm in your jurisdiction, and that you don't like guys like me. However, I think that these accusations are exaggerated and that we would benefit from working together. If that means a confession from you and therefore less paperwork for me, then we've got a deal. I'm serious. Can't you see what's going on right under your nose? Yeah? So what's going on that I don't know about? You'd be better off taking an interest in Dr. Fuller. The experiments he carries out on his patients are as inhuman as they are illegal. And when Dr. Colden wanted to put a stop to it, she too went under the knife. What are you talking about? Nobody's reported any wrongdoings. Dr. Fuller is a man who is as much respected and admired on the island as he is in his profession. It seems like you've got a grievance against him. Is that why you set fire to his institute? I'm admitting nothing at all. Come on, I'll show you to your new residence. 
I'll be back later to ask you some questions. I hope that you'll make the right choice and confess to everything. It would be as unpleasant for you as it would be for me if I had to adopt more advanced questioning. I have no doubt about that. Good night, <laughs> Mr. Pierce. Mr. Pierce. Matt. The truth seeker. We meet at last. Who's there? Oh. Oh. Okay. I am the one men named Leviathan. Not because of the scale of my terrestrial form, but as a reminder of the immensity of my knowledge. Which I came to share with you, human. Do not struggle. You will not be able to speak or escape my influence. Excellent. Your mind has begun to expand. Hmm. Your dreams have been gently shepherded by the being they call the Oracle. But it is your curiosity and your fate that have led you up to this moment. You are here to accept the knowledge and follow the path that leads to your freedom. This is an offer that the likes of you, particularly those with such rare characteristics, cannot refuse. The more you bend your human spirit to make it able to receive the truth, the closer you will come to embrace his power. Where is the Oracle, Truth Seeker? Would you like to see her? Where is the Oracle? Is she not the very object of your quest? I'll let you see for yourself. But do not forget. Your fate has already been written. Hmm. Our paths shall cross again, Truth Seeker. You know the risk, Sarah. If you happen to use your powers again, you... You may lose more than your life. It is not about me, but innocent lives. I hope that your sources are reliable. The bootleggers have the painting. If the dimensional shambler is to appear, he will do it here. <gasps> the shambler. I knew it. No. Not again. Yeah. Huh. Okay. Algernon, come back. Is Algernon and the Shambler? Hmm. No way back.
Sorry, old friend, but it's either you or me. No! What are you... No! Open! Open! Open up! Open this door! It's for you. Huh. Wieso war jetzt eigentlich Cat und der andere Typ da unten? Shambler can open breaches between dimensions. Wieso trägt der jetzt eigentlich das Amulett und nicht stay in our world? Nicht die Frau. Then I must destroy these glyphs. Exactly. How can I find them? I will make the glyphs visible so you can revoke them. Uh, by doing so, okay. this zone will be protected by a barrier. Perfect. Stay inside the shield. I'll create the protective barrier. Get back inside it as soon as you sense the slightest danger. Okay. He's getting the first glyph must have appeared somewhere on the floor. <lacht> Find that symbol, Sarah. It ich should react to the light dabei. if you use your lamp. Ah. Ich bin am Suchen. Find that symbol, Sarah. It should react to the light if you use your lamp. The first glyph must have appeared somewhere on the floor. Yeah. The glyph. I can't move it. Is it acting against me? The ritual is working. Don't worry. It's just until I ward it off. Oh no. The wanderer is back. The glyph is ready. Sir. Bah. Hilfe, Hilfe, Hilfe. Oh. The second symbol has been revealed. You know what you have to do, Sarah. Okay. That is what I'm doing. Is it? Cool. You 
You startled me, my friend. I have the impression the Shambler is trying to anticipate our actions. The second glyph must have appeared. Yeah. He's getting stronger and more aggressive. If he catches up with you, try blinding him. Is when matters get complicated. I must breach the barrier to ward off the creature. You have to lure it in front of me, Sarah. Yeah. Ich habe gedacht, ich komme vorbei. Yeah. Do you hear something? I can hear him. He calls me. Sarah! No! Algernon. It's too late. You must resist! Please! Don't!
Sarah Hawkins, together with Ergon and Drake, managed to permanently drive the Dimensional Shepard back at the end of a fierce battle. However, this feat of strength cost her what was left of her self-awareness. She has succumbed to the call of the myth. Hmm. Sarah Hawkins. Why did she do it? Damn it. Hmm. Okay. Hier machen wir beim nächsten Mal weiter. Ich muss sagen, sehr, sehr interessantes Spiel.